This video is about interior lighting basics. It will cover how to create and place some lights, including a ceiling light, a floor lamp, and how to create your own light. It will also cover how to adjust some settings to fine tune your light, and we'll go over the final results. Alright, so here's a little model I made that we'll use to quickly go over how to place a couple of different types of lights in iRender Next. So to start, you can just go up here to the Create Light Fixtures button, click on that, and up pops this dialog box. Now you'll see here there's a couple of different tabs. And these tabs just represent the different types of lights that you can create. Uh, for right now, I'm going to stick with a ceiling light. And you'll see that you can create either a rectangular light or a round light. I'm going to stay with the rectangular one, and I think I'm going to make it just a bit bigger. And then you'll see down here at the bottom these, these group of settings here, and they stay the same for each tab, which is kind of handy. Um, the intensity just simply means the, the brightness or the, the strength of the light. You can also change the color. And because I'm going to place a couple of these lights right now, I'm going to keep it on multiple. Now to place your light, simply position it where you want and click. Once you do that, you're ready to go. So uh, let's go ahead and render that and see what we get. Okay, here it is. Not too bad, right? Well, let's say I wanted to take this a step further by adding a floor lamp to complete our little living room scene here. To do that, go back up to the Create Light Fixtures button. And this time go to the Floor Light tab. Uh, so this is where you can change the settings and look of your floor lamp. So for me, I'm going to go with this shade, and I'm going to go with this base. I'm going to change the base color to this uh, bright red over here. And then the shade is just a little bit too tall for me, and I'm only going to be creating one of these so we can keep it on single. And then just create it, and again, click to place it, and you're done. You're ready to go. So let's render this and see what we get. Okay, and here we go. Pretty good. We got some nice shading going on over here on this side of the room, as well as some nice highlights on the ceiling and floor. But it is still pretty dark over here on this side of the room, so uh, let's add some lights over there. But this time we're going to create our own lights. So to do that, you're going to need something that you want to turn into a light source. So for me, I happen to have these wall sconces on the wall over here already. So to start making your own light, you're going to need to select the object or faces you want to turn into a light right click and go to set object properties. When you do that up pops this light properties dialog. Now this is where you can change the settings for the light you wish to create. So uh, let's go over a couple of these. Uh, diffuse means light will only shine from in one direction from uh, any given face and that direction is controlled down here uh, by these axes and these are the same axes as SketchUp axes. And then omnidirectional means that light will shine in all directions from any given face. So because I have a three-dimensional light, um, I'm going to go with that. Okay, once you get your room set up and you're happy with it, you're ready to go. You can click render and see what you get. So let's do that. Okay, and here it is. Here's the final rendering. Take note of the uh, soft shadows and highlights created both on the floor and on the ceiling. And then here they all are. I think our final rendering is a huge improvement over the first and even over the second one. Now remember, this was done pretty quickly. And if we wanted to, we could spend some more time uh, adding some more lights, fine-tuning the positioning and the settings of them to get it just right. But uh, I think this works pretty well for now. Okay, thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.